look who's working for the Chronicle. With them fellas, it's no trick to get circulation. You're right, Mr. Bernstein. You know how long it took the Chronicle to get that staff together? 20 years. 20 years. Well, six years ago, I looked at a picture of the world's greatest newspaper men. I felt like a kid in front of a candy store. Well, tonight, six years later, I got my candy. All of it. <laughs> Welcome, gentlemen, to the Inquirer. Make up an extra copy of that picture and send it to the Chronicle, will you? <laughs> It'll make you all happy to learn that our circulation this morning was the greatest in New York, 684,000. 684,132! Right. And enough welcome, you. I hope you'll forgive my rudeness in taking leave of you. I'm going abroad next week for a vacation. I promised my doctor for some time now that I'd leave when I could, and I now realize that I can't. <laughs> hey, Mr. Kane, as long as you're promising, there's a lot of pictures and statues in Europe you haven't bought yet. You can't blame me, Mr. Bernstein. They've been making statues for 2,000 years. And I've only been buying for five. Promise me, Mr. Kane. I promise you, Mr. Bernstein. Thank you. Mr. Bernstein. Yes? You don't expect me to keep any of those promises, do you? <laughs> and now, gentlemen, your complete attention, if you please. <laughs>